Hello there kids, it is I, Stray Cat, the one and only, coming to you with another episode of Fable Anniversary. Alright, when we left off, we were in the middle of trying to head across the entirety of the Guild of Heroes over to where we're supposed to start our training, which this will be... Where the main meals are served. Okay. The melee ring is outside, across the bridge. Sounds good. Are you going to give me a little bit of a tour as I walk around? Dylan, this is shop the guild people. shop. When you're older, can you can buy you stuff something? here. Okay, fair enough. I will uh, keep that in mind. And I guess we're going to go... Uh, let's see what, if she gives me a little snippet of what's over here. Nope. Okay. Does not seem like it. Ah, well. I was hoping that she might have something new that I haven't heard before. But it seems not like... There's much else to do in that regard. Okay, let's just go away from here. I cannot walk straight, apparently. There we go. Is she right behind me? Yeah, she's right behind me. Hey, Whisper, let's get going, huh? We should be going, anyway. At least, that's the way you made it seem. Considering I was the one late, and yet you're following me. Alrighty. You've hey, good master. Prized yourself from your pillow, I see. Yeah. Oh, come on then. Let's see what you're capable of. Alrighty. All right, lad. It's time to see if you've any potential. Get in the ring. Fair enough. Can do. Now then, I want you to hit that dummy as hard as you can. With Just my fist. Just keep going till I tell you to stop. Okay. Uh, target the dummy, circle around the target, and attack. Okay. Fair enough. Back hit. Back hit. Back hit. Yeah, there we go. And a couple of hits to the front. Take that. All right. I'm not making much of an impact there, are you? Well, not with my fist, yeah. no. Try with this. A stick. Oh, glory me, a stick. <laughs> damage 20. I don't know how a stick manages to make that much damage, but... Oh! you say current value five okay uh, we'll equip the stick okay alrighty there we go and beat him around a little bit there we go yeah he's getting knocked around ah now that's more like it yeah it is when you destroy an enemy like this dummy it drops an experience orb. the proper orbs these orbs contain the knowledge gained from killing the creature yeah it's very important that you collect these orbs, or you won't learn anything. Oh, no. Now pick it up. Alrighty. You can pick them up by walking over them, or pull and hold the right trigger to drag them towards you. I like the right trigger version. Well done, lad. Now then, tomorrow we'll... Alright. That's the guild alarm. Sounds like there might be something loose in the woods. Ah. This is a good opportunity to test your spirit. Is it? I'll wait for you at the guild woods entrance. While you deal with the problem. All Once right. you're done, we can talk I'll about starting that. your training. Sounds good to me. Ooh, I get 20 gold for doing it. I'm going to do it then. And I get 30 Halo points. I think that's what that is. I guess. I don't know. Good. That's good karma, I guess. Zero out of zero boasts. Come on. I want to do boasting already. But then again, I'm a kid. It'd be kind of weird. Kill the beetles infesting the guild wards. Alright, I did that. Alright, let's go all the way over here. Get these dealt with. Alright, let's just run it. Woo! Alright, guild wards. There we are. Ha <laughs> ha! Over time, your appearance will change to reflect these alterations, as will the reaction of those around you. I have what uh, alterations? It didn't really mention that. I assume that blob of red is where all the enemies and beetles are. I assume, anyway. Could be wrong. Hey! Okay, there we go. I'm just bopping them around. Whoop, I'm missing this one. There we go. Collect all those. Okay, great. And that. And... There we go. And there we go. And one more. Haha. 
Hey, melee combat test passed. All right, and we got 40, got 20 gold. That's always good. And we are good. Yeah. Fuck to the yeah. All right. Let's see what else we got going on around here. We got. Oh, I can't swim. Is that what you're telling me? I can't swim. Oh man, too short. That's probably what it is. I'm too short. Man, five nights sucks. <laughs> Apparently. All right. Otherwise, Markiplier wouldn't be complaining about being five nine so much. Or what is he? Five ten? Actually, yeah, that's an inch off. Senpai, you're taller than me by about Good an inch. Work, lad. Those beetles can be a damn nuisance. Yeah, the tend yeah. to be. I think you've earned yourself some pocket money for that. If you want more gold, I'm sure the servants could use your help with something. Sounds or good. Or you can get an early night. Uh, do you wish to leave your childhood behind and begin apprentice training? Yes, I would. Because that the would be awesome. The guild was now the boy's life. The memory of the Oakvale flames still scorched his mind, yeah. but soon he had no thought other than training, and he became stronger and more agile with every passing year. Yeah. His days were filled with grueling exercises, the nights with study in the library. Finally, he was ready to become a guild apprentice, just as Maze had foreseen. The real yeah. training was about to begin. Well, hopefully. Because I want to beat those Get guys. Get out of bed, lazy bones. Oh, we were so there we go. Text was loaded in. the guild master on the other side of the river, but that was an hour ago. Oh, come we on. We better get going. Race you there. Alrighty. To run, hold the... Not I know how to do the racing. Alrighty. Are you going to actually move? No, of course not. Uh, I'm going to look through... Nothing interesting. Nothing interesting. I'm just going to look around, see what I can get. Ooh! The Crindon Tattoo. What the hell is that? The Crindons are an old order of assassins who live normal lives by day. A tattooist will be able to apply it to your body. Alrighty. Fair enough. A tattoo card. That's always a good thing to find. Although, I think that one's probably not the best karma. A love story, eh? Oh, we can read these. Okay, well, a little snippet anyway. Ralph. I almost read that as Rolf for a second, but that would be an O, Ed boy. Uh, <clears throat> was a hero who fought bravely and well, but his face showed the scars of battle, and frankly, no woman would look at him. That's kind of rude. In his despair, he robbed the ancient trader barons of Greatwood and bought a house and a pile of presents to give out. Women fell at his feet, and eventually he chose a gorgeous one to marry. But too late, he realized that the type of female who is impressed by gifts and houses is too shallow to make a good bride. So Ralph decapitated her and waved her lovely head around in triumph, and the phrase trophy wife was born. Well, that was a twist. Or four. Alrighty, oh, now she goes. Jesus. Woman, what? Damn it. I'm gonna lose the race. Three haikus by Miko the Bard. Uh, terrible beauty, Billion screaming in agony. Oakvale is burning. Warrior or maid, choose evil or choose goodness. A beard or mustache. Sword of Albion, sleeping until the true blood flows red on its blade. Okay. Well, if I'm going to lose the race, I might as well already start looting everything else. By looting, I mean checking every bookcase I find. Because, fuck it. Because, fuck it. Oh, there's another one. Uh, the Tale of Max Slayer. As everyone knows, Hobbs are stupid creatures. But everyone, every so often, a clever one comes along. Maxley was one such Hob. And tired of eating raw flesh and, seeping, and sleeping in streams... <clears throat> he left to seek his fortune in the world of humans. He murdered a nobleman and stole his clothes, dressed up and walked tall on the road to Bowerstone. 
When he arrived, people complimented him on his appearance. When he answered, his hob grunting gave him away. The guards killed Maxley and put his head on a spike. It is better to keep quiet and be thought an idiot than to open one's mouth and prove it. That is very true. Some particular politicians should listen to that advice. <coughs> Trump. <coughs> Oops, I'm sorry. Did I just cough a little bit more into your ear than you probably should have heard? Yeah, I did. I'm sorry. Alrighty, let's head across because Whisper is probably already there gloating. And at this point, I just want to be there to prove a point. Yeah, Whisper's there already. Late again. You do seem to have a problem getting up, lad. Yeah, yeah, I do. But can you blame me? After all, I see. You can put that old stick away. We'll begin training with real weapons now. Ooh. Get used to the weight of this sword. And let's see if you can hit Whisper with it. Wait, what? Ooh. I lost. But you're a wizard, hero. Uh, no, I'm not. <laughs> A functional, if weathered, sword wrapped in simple leather bindings and undecorated. The long sword is equally effective in defense and attack and has been the mainstay of heroes throughout Albion's long history. Sounds good to me. I'm gonna take that. Sounds Come on, good then. to me. Let's see what you've got, farm boy. Hey! There's no need to bring my, uh, past into this, huh? Okay, well. Okay. Oh, I managed to get a hit on that one. Nice. Come on, lad. Hit her. Well, oh, I'm trying. Lucky shot. There we go. Now pay attention. What I'm about to teach you could well save your life one day. Well, I'd hope it would. The life of a hero is a dangerous one, and you must learn to block your enemy's attacks if you expect to live long. Or parry. Whisper will try to hit you, but you can block her attacks with your sword. Yeah. Not all blows can be blocked, but you should be able to handle anything Whisper can throw at you. Well, I'd hope so. Press and hold down the RB button to block. Okay. You can roll out of the way of your enemy's attacks using the right stick. Okay. Uh, or left stick, rather. Ha-ha! <laughs> ha <laughs> Damn it! How did you stop that? Well, I'm, I'm good. That's what. Ha <laughs> ha! Nice try. Ha <laughs> ha! Well done. Now let's see if you can combine attack and defense. I should be able to. Who's this guy? Ah, oh, hello, Thunder. Come to check on your sister's progress, have you? Oh! You could say that. Whisper told me you've got a training with some fan boy. And? Maze thinks the boy has great potential. Enough to keep up with my Whisper. Ha. <laughs> well, why don't we see? Whisper and the boy are just working on their melee skills now. Alrighty, I guess we'll be doing this All sort of right, thing. children. Let's see who has learnt the most in their training. Fair enough. This will be a no-holes-barred duel. Just like your final melee test. Fair enough. Prepare yourselves. Can do. Alright. Okay, let's hit her around a little bit. Whoop. Well, apparently she's not doing that very well, but then again, I kind of wasn't doing that that well either. Alright, come on. There we go. And there That's we go. all wrong, Whisper. You need to practice more. Shame you couldn't see me fight in the arena. You might have learned a thing or two. Your arm seems Keep like it's busted if, if you're holding it like that. One day. I could have Fair beaten enough. him if you hadn't stopped us. We have few enough heroes as it is. Without the two of you tearing each other apart in training. That's a good point. Speaking of which, meet me as I make my way to the archery range. When you're ready to continue your lessons. Fair enough, now, I can about do that. Your melee performance. Really? Excellent. Fight like that in your melee exam and you'll do well. Hey! I did good! Okay. Do you want to continue or repeat melee training? I'd rather continue. Then meet just to me get ourselves the along. To continue your training. Sounds good. Will do. Alrighty. Hey, Whisper. No hard feelings, eh? Shouldn't you be practicing your archery? I'm just making sure there's no hard feelings. Come on, girl. Damn. Okay. Alright, Guildmaster. Are you ready for your archery training? Yep. I'm ready for it. Let's continue our training with the bow. Yes, let's do that. 
Hey, the Yu Longbow. Nice. But you're a wizard here. Oh, no, I'm not. No, I'm not. Let's be perfectly clear here. I had to drink my soda. Pardon me. The weapon of archers and large armies, a Yu Longbow is long, resilient, and powerful. Alrighty. Sounds good to, to me. To begin with, see if you can hit the three stationary targets. Alright. And put some effort into it. The longer you pull back your bowstring, the more damage you will cause. Sounds good. But make sure you stay within the circle. I can do that. Maybe. We'll find out. Okay. Press the Y button to unsheath the bow, and lock onto the target, and use... Yeah, I know. I know how to use melee weapons. I played Fable 3. Alright. There we go. And... There we go. And... There we go. Perfect. Well done. You hit all the targets. Yeah! Unfortunately, most foes don't stand still. Yeah. So let's see how you fare against moving targets. You have a minute to score as many points as you can. Sounds good. The front target is worth one point. The middle one is worth three. And the mm -hmm. one at the back will score you nine points. Hey! And remember, the longer you pull back your bowstring, the more damage the shot will cause. Yep, will that more actually get me more points? more points? Hey! But you have to balance power, firing rate, and accuracy. Oh, great. Let's see what you can do. Well, let's find out. Okay, switch between view modes. Okay. Fair enough, I can do that. Get your bow out. But once I do that, it has to start, right? Or at least when I hit something, anyway. There we go. There we go, I got that one. Got that. Oh, damn it, I missed that one. Damn it, I missed the other one. Get that. Oh, come on, that was bullshit. I should have hit. Oh, come on. I'm waiting for the opportune moment. Ah, I got him. There we go. Oh, damn it. Okay. There we go. Damn it all. There we go. Got that one. Got that one. Oh, come on. That was dead on. There we go. Well, I'm trying. Believe me. There we go. Got that one. Damn it. Okay. Excellent shooting, my lad. Do that in your skill test, and I'll be most impressed. Sounds good. How'd I do, really? And points. I didn't really look at that. <laughs> I was busy trying to make sure I hit the targets. Uh, let's continue, then. Next, we will learn about the ways of the will. Really? Speak to me when you're ready to continue with your training. Okay. And I'll be heading to the island by the waterfall. Island by the waterfalls. Alrighty. Fair enough. Well, we have... Currently, the bow and the sword, which means I can use those whenever I please. But there's always a third option, and I figure that's going to be the will, Ooh, the will, which will be in the uh, other slot. I also like how in the little buttons in the bottom, it's showing, you know, the colors of the actual buttons that are involved there. I like that. That's a nice touch. I very much like it. All right, let us go and There's just do the will. will left to learn. One thing. Sounds good. It's time to learn about will powers. We'll begin by striking these straw dummies with lightning. All righty. All right, let's see what you've got. Lightning is a mainstay that I like. All right, pull and hold the R, the right trigger, <coughs> to access your will powers. Available powers will be displayed in the bottom right of the screen. All right, your power can be accessed this way by using the B button. To use your lightning power, press the B button. Alrighty. Okay. And... There we go. What? Oh, there we go. Apparently I wasn't doing it right. See how many you can hit in half a minute. Half a minute, Only huh? attack dummies that are facing the center of the island. You won't get any points hmm. for hitting one on the back. You will only waste valuable mana. Alrighty. Using your willpowers depletes your mana. And once used, it takes time to replenish. Fair enough. 
not exactly the same in most of the other games, but... There we go. Okay. There we go. Oh, come on. Come on. Damn it. It's not working like it should. There we go. Perfect. Oh, I don't want to attack him on accident. Okay, come on. There we go. Perfect. That always works. There we go. Good stuff. Eh, I did a little Excellent better than most. Use of magic. Well done. Thank you. Alrighty. Uh, do you want to continue or repeat will training? I'd rather not. Very good, lad. You have learnt the three hero disciplines. Yay! We can now move on to your final test if you're ready. Or you can spend some more time exploring the guild. Fair enough. I believe Whisper is about to go into the guild woods if you wish to join her. Fair enough. Uh, do you wish to continue to the next stage of your training and into adulthood or play with Whisper first? I want to kind of play with Whisper. Very well. I'll be in the map room when you're ready to continue. Sounds good. I will see you there in a moment. But first things first, we're going to head over to the woods and figure out what Whisper wants. Oh, oh, I need keys for that, and I don't have enough at all. Any princes want to practice melee combat? Well, not particularly right now, no. Not really. Hey, Whisper. What are we doing? Come on, let's hunt beetles. I'll follow you into the woods. Sounds good. We'll see if we uh, find anything else in the woods, eh? It'll always be fun, right? Something else pops up. Other than beetles. Alright. Just keeping the woods clean of beetles. The beetle nest is just at the top of the... Oh. Wait. Did you hear that? It's coming from over there. That it is. Bandits. If only we could get across that stream. Yeah. I know. Why don't you use your bow? Or some of that lightning the guildmaster taught you? I'll heal you if you get hurt. Fair enough. That sounds good to me. Okay, let's see if we can... Uh... Oh, that's not going to work at all. So, at least not this way. Uh, buggery. How in the hell am I supposed to hit them? I guess I have to use the bow then. Okay. Come on. There we go. Ow! You little shit. Okay. That one's dead. And... Ow! You little shit. Fuck you. Okay, that one's dead. There we go. Oh, and he missed. Nice. All right. Ha <laughs> ha! Nice. We did it. Did you see the look on their faces? Well, I couldn't really, because they were Wait really till far the away. Wait guildmaster hears about this. Sounds good. Hey, hey, we managed to stop a bandit attack. Nice. Well, at least an attempted one. Can we eventually get over there? Is that a thing? Eventually, I can do. Oh, maybe when I'm more of an adult and can actually get through the stream. Apparently, I'm not allowed to right now. Ugh, stupid. Okay, can I get across this way? No, of course not. I gotta love the collision. Okay. Let us go back to the Heroes Guild. And head along towards the next thing. Oh, boy. I'm gonna drink my soda real quick while it's loading. Faster than I thought. Okay. All right. Where are we going, Whisper? Heading over Any princes want here. To his melee combat? Oh, he's still in the process of walking over. Okay, Guildmaster. I'm, I'm ready for you. All right. Let's progress to our final training because we've now finished the teenage years era. The boy mastered the skills quickly, but there was always more to learn. There is always more to learn. For years, the guild was his home, his school, and his life. Mm -hmm. 
But as time passed, his thoughts returned always to the world outside. The life he had lost, the family that had been torn from him. Mm -hmm. At last, only the final day of tests remained. Success would mark the end of his training. Yep. He would receive the guild seal and be free to forge his own destiny. He would become a hero. Always good things. Before you graduate, there is one final test you must complete. Is there? Enter the guild woods and go to the log at the top of the hill. Hmm. The test will be revealed to you there. Good Alrighty. luck. Alrighty. Okay, well, that seems to be what we need to do. But we are a little bit over time, so I'm going to end the episode here for right now and save the checkpoint. Uh, can I do it over the last one? No, of course not. So I'm just going to save it right here. Anyway, thank you all so much for watching. Click the subscribe button if you like these videos and you want to see more. And click the like button if you like this particular video. And share and comment so we can bring more people into this community. We can talk about the games we're playing together. And I will see y'all in the next episode. This has been the one the only Stray Cat playing games and becoming a hero for you.